Hello and welcome to episode 10 of our Machine Key playthrough. Uh, we are heading to the third era today, which is the early diesel age. So we get to see some diesel trains. Our, our massive moonlight train is heading off into the distance. And this is our quest. Uh, I'm going to do these two just for now. We'll come back to this in a second. What I want to do before we head off uh, is check, <laughs> let's just check things are going according to plan over here. One thing I have noticed, we could probably be building some extensions because this is, takes uh, wood tokens, which we have an abundance of now. We'll, we'll, we'll just stick that in there, right? There we go. Lovely. We've got loads of uh, cash tokens and loads of coal tokens. This we're a bit stuck on at the moment, but it didn't really help that uh, this this whole section here was a little bit uh, skew whiffy for a long time. How are we doing here? Now nah, you see, I'm not picking those up fast enough, but I thought about upgrading trains. I want to see our full selection. I'm going to stop moving the camera around super fast. We've got a nice area here. I think we have everything we really want. What I want to check is not that, is the actual tool works. Yeah, this is fully upgraded. And we do have everything going along. Here comes our lumber train. Look at you go. I've checked the amount of towns we have. Three that are not being serviced before we move in. And we do have a lot. I'm just letting some of these tick up. I want to make sure we have, you know, a, a good chunk of iron before we move. I mean, it doesn't really matter. We can uh, we can use the new trains, perhaps, to increase throughput of our iron foundries. Can we? I, I would imagine so. I mean, they're fully, fully upgraded. Maybe we'll get more upgrades available. We have a loading speed there, so that's good. I mean, the only thing we can really do... Uh, look at that! We have 300 iron ingots waiting there. So, so here's the thinking. We move to the th third era, like now. I'm going to save this quickly. This is a tip, by the way, if you're going to move on. Uh, we're going to quickly save it. Now we're going to move on. That means if RNG is not in our favour, we, uh, we can do a bit of a scum save. And, uh, and reload uh, reload it and do it again. And I'll, I'll I'll edit that out for you. You won't have to watch it. Should we do this? I, I've I've not seen any uh, any more quest pop. I did leave it playing before this episode just to make sure there were no more quests. There aren't. So are you ready? Here we go. Let's pause it because we've got a lot to uh, got a lot to figure out. Wow, this time I have a really amazing news. Sources at the Ministry of Industry suggest that recently in this region, prospectors found small deposits of black gold, oil. So now we've got oil tokens sitting here. The government naturally saw the potential of this and the ministry is already using subsidies to attract investors to drill. There is almost certainly more oil out there and if we act quickly, we could make a solid profit from this. From this oil discovery will come industries for fuel and chemicals. So we have a great opportunity to improve our locomotive fleet with diesel powered engines. It'll need us to invest, but the rewards will be great. I'm down with that. Diesel. Loving it. So here's our first uh, quest from uh, John Ross Horsefly Fry. <laughs> John Ross Horsefry. He's a sales manager. Of course you are, John. I'm a sales representative of U-Wing Oil. As the name suggests, our company is engaged in oil extraction and processing. We are looking for new partners to transport our oil by rail around the region. Interested? Speak to my secretary, who will get the papers signed with you. A little bit of advice from Andra was to complete this as soon as possible and... To be fair, I completely agree, because we do want to get oil going. First off, where is everything? Because it, it's going to land everywhere, isn't it? Interesting. What is this? Shops. 
Shops will also increase town. When, I mean, money really isn't a problem, so we might not need to. We'll probably hook one up just for the sake of it. Uh, I don't know what it actually serves other than giving you extra cash at the moment. That isn't a problem for us. We may do it. Uh, if you click on a... I've never checked. If we click on a town, nothing in the extensions tab. I was wondering whether we'd have extensions. Should we look... Where's this... Uh, there. This foundry. Uh, well, this is the foundry near Armar. We're, we're not shifting this. I think the best bet here is to see what trains we have available. And we can use this one because I, if you remember, I shunted around. Because I would like more of this. We are really low. And then we can hook up an oil well, hopefully. This looks like a good spot right there. Isn't that convenient? Let's, we don't need another locomotive works, really? That's good news. Let's have a look at our engines then. Remember, we've brought one of each. So let's scroll down. Now we, oh, is that British Rail? Is that a class three? BR3, I, I bet it is. I didn't mean to buy it though, that's awkward. We can't buy these yet. I, I don't know whether I should have brought that. It did give us a new quest by buying it. So we're not gonna be able to get, until we get oil production going, we are not gonna be able to get any of the big boys. And they're quite powerful. So we've got the EMDF3, the BDZ, BDZ or BDZ52. How does that compare to the GS2? See, the GS2 just is just a beast. Still. This runs on, on coal as well. These run on oil, which we're never going to run. This little thing, though, I would imagine it runs better than, than the Prussian. Oh, news for you. This should say Russian, but uh, due to copyright issues, <laughs> they've, they've cheekily called it Russian. But it is a Russian, so there we go. I don't know whether to use this. I mean, it's expensive. The pulling power is quite nice, and it can carry up to 252 tons, which is way better than the Prussian. And that might be an idea to double, double head those for short distances, just for pulling power. These are not really worth it, are they? They might as well just go with these. I guess they could become useful. The AMD F3 looks like it could really nail passenger routes. At 81 miles per hour, they can carry 453 ton, nothing like this thing. This is what we're going to use then. Sell that, you're, you're lovely. But I don't want, oh, we did get, uh, we did get uh, half back. That's not bad. This is what I want to buy, and this is going to be now shifting our iron ingots here, and I bet we can make a lot, oh, see, look, yeah, we, but if we invest now on this guy, with these big ones, how many can we have, like, quite a decent haul, nothing runs on iron, so, <laughs> we can uh, get as many in there as possible, we don't care about oversize, uh, how are we doing? One more. How much are these? 58 tons, 58. Yeah, we can carry another. Can we carry one more? Eight will take us to... No, we can't. I don't want to go overweight. This is perfect. And it, it, it happens to be just what we can afford. So I would like to copy his orders to uh, this guy here. And we should be able to just send him on his way. Does he start at the right one? Which is there. Yeah, brilliant. So let's get let's get a real train going, shall we? This dude can go back to the depot. Are they gonna are they gonna get in each other's way? And can he actually get to the depot from there? I don't think he can, can he? So what I'd like to do is we'll have a separate depot. Or we can upgrade our track. Yes. We should do that, uh, but not for not for the depot. We don't care about that. Go that way. Block that off there so they don't get in each other's way. Couple there, and then a clearing signal there. That's beautiful. Uh, this should um, 
We need one there as well, otherwise that will block him. Now we can send him to the depot, I believe, quite happily. Uh, go to depot, you are done. We don't need any of your orders anymore. Clear all would be great, maybe there is a way, I don't know. There we go. So you can go to the depot now. Job done. Let's just keep an eye on that. Let's put it in Prettyville. Yes, he can. No, he can't, because I, I set that signal wrong. <laughs> I'm awful. Does this mean we get... What's this? Upgrade. Okay. I was wondering how this would be done. Uh, this should be that way around. Just saying. There we go. Off you go. We should maybe upgrade this, though. Does it cost... How much does it cost? It doesn't say anywhere, does it? Does that say how much that costs? Is, is it just free? Well, a price would have been amazing, but thank you. Uh, it's just gold, though, right? We're, uh, cash. We're, we're fine on cash. Let's get it all upgraded, shall we? Oh, we did it! That counts! That's beautiful. I'll take some, some of that. That's nice. Uh, yeah, there we go. We have upgraded that. Where's our passenger line? That could do with an upgrade. This one. Don't crash. And there. There we go. I mean, we're, we're, we've got so much money, it really doesn't matter. Beautiful. It's not going to make no difference at the moment. Let's get back into there and see, uh into pretty view or a aesthetically pleasing view and there he goes should we upgrade these bridges or can you upgrade bridges or do you have to tear them down and rebuild them does it matter oh yeah because he gets up to speed but he has to slow down for this corner right i don't know how much it slows down he's in the depot we can sell him oh look at the lights wait a minute let's get on board Let's get on board. Did you see the see the signals? Other side. Look at the signals. Oh, that's beautiful. I love this. I didn't know he did up upgraded signals too. Right, so we've got a much bigger train. He can carry 72, which is far better. And I think that will give us the throughput we need here. Anything we can build here? Uh, not really of interest at the moment. I mean, yes, that's delayed us a little bit. Right, let's uh, nip to this depot. Let's sell this train that we have in there. It's empty, right? Surely. Just sell it. Just sell it. No one cares. Get rid of it. Yep. Getting some uh, lumber tokens there. Let's hook this up. This seems uh, like a, a perfect little hookup right here. And, oh, do you know what we could have used on there? The little little diesel train. Hindsight. Let's get this in. How are we going to run this? Just in a little loop, I think. I think that'll be perfect. We go from about there. And this one can go just there. I mean, they almost touch, don't they? I want it a little bit further back. Why don't I just start from here? That would make it far easier. I mean, why not, right? What's the difference in price then? Let's see. Uh, 65. And for normal track, which is probably all we need around here. Yeah, might as well. Let's be frugal. Let's go round. I think we've got enough uh, room to upgrade everything. Uh, that is beautiful. This almost looks like one of those little... Little carnival rides or funfair rides you get where you get the little train that just goes around. We can uh, we can get you up there both ways, so we can always upgrade. I kind of like the idea of getting a nice little diesel on the map, don't you guys? I think that would be beautiful. So that's started. Let's upgrade it if we can. Uh, it's pricey. Sure. I mean, we can afford, like, anything like that. That'll be brilliant. And it'll look cool, too. Get in. 
let's make sure we're loading full speed. Extensions. We want a not a waiting room. We do want this though. I would love them to be loading at full speed. Kind of. I don't know which way rounds best for this. There's this way. Like that, and it kind of puts the... Let's go, go into this view. We'll let this load up a little bit first. Yeah, this this way kind of looks cool. It looks like they're going to start loading on. Well, I do like that. Uh, What train's waiting? Oh, we've done that. Oh, yeah, look at him go now. And he's running at full speed, except for up to the bridge. But it does slow down over there. I did wonder... How this, uh, how you got these signals. I like them. I must admit, I do like them. I do like them a lot. That looks way better, doesn't it? That's beautiful. Good job, Jan. And team. I don't know whether it's just you. Whether you got some artists on, on board. Beautiful. So that should increase our throughput of iron tokens up here. I guess what we really should do then is uh, throw another one. See, the other way around is this. I don't, I don't know which is better. Because that could be trucks loading into here, right? I mean, technically. I think the other way around is better, but we'll leave it. Here comes our train. This should help uh, throughput on the tall works here. No end. Train 20 is... Train 20? What are you waiting for? Uh, someone said about this. Uh, there is a bug where... Oh, look. And they're now all bunched up. There is a bug when you upgrade tracks and they'll wait for absolutely zero reason. Fortunately, we don't need that signal anymore. So perhaps we can fix it. I hope so. Otherwise, our, our map is just uh, ruined. Which would be a little sad. Let's just get rid of it. See what happens. Will he go through the next signal fine? We don't need that signal anyway. It's, uh, it's not required. We could hold him up. Let's stop him. Let's speed that up actually. And make sure everything's going to work. We can uh, be sitting making some more. Iron ingot. Iron tokens. Yeah look that's fixed it. If you get that problem then just delete the signal. You can probably do other things to it too. This guy. I feel like he can go to the depot now. To be perfectly honest. He is no longer required. So let's do that for him. I think this monstrous beast we have going around here. Can handle all of that goodness. Quite easily. Should we upgrade this track too? I mean I don't know whether he'll need it. But we could. Let's do that. Hopefully they don't get stuck at the signals, but uh, um, perhaps he'll get up to speed. Who knows? Let's have, let's take a look, shall we? He might, indeed. Oh, we've got excessive... Okay. Okay, I can see why we've got more signals there. We don't really need that one. Doesn't matter, but I mean, we might as well remove them. That one doesn't... Isn't required. Can you get back to the... Uh, let's wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. I don't know whether he can get back. I know I'm, I'm all sorts of distracted. But is there a way for... That he that would just be going around there all day. Well, you might have to do another loop. We'll send you in... How? Which depot can you use? We could, of course, get him back to that depot quite easily. If we send him... Actually, we could just come out here, right? If we send him like this, because this is a depot line. And then we send him... I mean, we can send him straight in, couldn't we? We don't need to worry too much about these lines crossing, obviously, because it's just uh, for going into depots. So we'll just do them like that, and that'll be fine, I think. And then we'll do one there to make sure that's not blocking. Clear that one. This is fine. Go. Now can you find your way in? He should be able to. He should go this way. 
Yeah, he should go that way. Then he should find his way up there. I, I just remembered that you can press space to flip that. He's got to go all around the houses, but he should find his way there. No, it's him. He's made it. Good for you. Proud of you. Ten people are going to be very confused very shortly. Let's get back to... There should be enough oil here now. Where are we? Here. To get our train going. Let's do that. We are going to buy one of these because they're beautiful. Oh, look at how much iron we're making now. And that's just one run that we upgraded. We'll get we'll get more of that going. Definitely. We're a bit short on uh, the old coal though. We might need to work on that. I think this little, little BR3, Class 3. British Rail Class 3. Little shunter. Will be perfect for this. He can carry quite a bit. I don't think we need to uh, worry about it. I don't know what oil... Oh, we can use either. I mean, we might as well go for the uh, the big ones. They're 32. Well, we could technically get one more in and be slightly overweight. I mean, given the distance, it doesn't really matter. That means we can pull quite a few. 49. Look at that. I'd like to give him some orders because I'm not sure where he's going to go. Go there first. Then there. And then there. I think you're good now. Off you go. Let's have a look at our first diesel train. The Class 3. Oh yes. That is definitely a Class 3. Oh, and then our train has made it to the depot. You're a very quiet diesel, sir. You sound more electric than diesel. Where's, where's the chugging sound? Come on. Maybe when you get on it, he sounds better. Well, I mean, it's a sound. He's a bit... He's a bit juddery around the corners. Is that a thing? Are you just working on that, Jan? I don't know. Someone let me know. Is that just a work in progress? I am going to assume that. Uh, we don't have any signalling, but we only have one train. He might get confused. Let's signal up. Uh, does it matter which one of these we use? Probably not. Let's signal up. The other way, please. Thank you. And do the same there. Beautiful. And there. And I think we'll just manually do this bit. So that nothing crazy goes on. In the middle there. One clearing there. Beautiful. That should protect all of that. And two way there. Excellent. I think we're good there. Right, he's going to go and pick up our first bit of oil, which is already nearly filled up. But he's a beast of a train. I mean, given that he's just one little shunter on there, that's awesome. Let's have a look at him come through the station, shall we? I mean, he's amazing. We're still using semaphores because the, it, it's based, these signals are based on what sort of track you've got. But look at the nodding donkeys. Well, I do like having a diesel, even if he's not really loud enough to be a diesel. I can see flames in the background. I mean, he's all right, isn't he? Perhaps they'll work on the sounds. Or I'm misremembering uh, exactly how a little Class 3 sounds. I thought they were quite loud and growly. What extensions can we put on here? We don't really want to be producing goods, do we? Perhaps soon, but not yet. This I would like. What are we currently doing? Two oil, one yes. This I would definitely like. Plus it would look awesome. Uh, get in there. Look. That is massive. Excellent. And this is something we'll need to do at a later date. We can get rid of our train now. I'm sorry for the 10 people that were on here, but uh, you are no longer no longer required. Okay. Oh, you can I'm I'm some of them, <laughs> some of the UI elements, you have to keep clicking to use them except for sell. That's a toggle. Just so you know. Okay, this is done.
this oil thing here should we don't actually need to click connect up the oil drums i would like to i'd like to get that done now where is our i've lost my bearings because we flew over there so we're going to be beginning our oil with five oil and makes three drums which is not a bad ratio ratio now where do we turn stuff into oil it's going to be producing I was hoping the tool works might uh, take oil. But no, 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 it doesn't. So where's the nearest factory? It's looking like the only way to make oil tokens is a factory. There's a factory there. And there's one up there and we've got to take it from here. It's got to be this factory, surely. That looks like the closest to me. Gently turn it. That looks like it is the closest. That's the one. Does mean we're going to have to cross this line. It's a little awkward. But okay, something we can deal with. We've already got some barrels in there. We're, we're probably doing this. Yes, we're doing that. Let's build us a, a little line over there, shall we? I would like this definitely to be an upgraded version. I mean, if we just cross straight over and get out the way, where are we going? Yeah, we're going up there. Yeah, then let's do that. Let's just get straight over there, out the way. Like that. Let's signal it up so I remember. But let's get rid of that one. That, that one's pointless now. Probably don't need that one. In fact, we could even it out. No, that's not needed. Okay, that's, that's that way. Can we get round here? We can. It's going to be an absolute mess, but we can. Go through there. We should move this signal up closer. That way. We don't need a bajillion signals, really. Okay, that one's a bit too close. Don't like that. That makes me nervous. Let's put that one there. Uh, this one is coming this way. I love these new signals though. They are awesome. And a clearing one there. Clearing one there. This nightmare of a of a junction should work if we're face if we're going the right way, which is that way. I think all of uh, oh, do you know what I've just realised, guys? Can you see it? If we have an over length train, his back end's going to stick here. And ruin this train's day. So we need to we need to account for that. I almost fluffed that up royally. Get rid of that. This is uh this here. What is that? This isn't a route. No, that's just the depot. Oh, how much how much length are we gonna have on these trains? Because I don't want to hold trains up unnecessarily. If we give it that, can we go, like, around there? How long are we going to need this to back up? That give us... That's six. And then that's five. So that's 11. We can go over that one. That's 12. If we can have up to 12. That'll be okay, I guess. Because we're going to need to get round, aren't we? Oh. I'd prefer to come round sooner. No, no, what are you talking about? You can have more than that. It's only once you get over to these. That's right. This is going to be an interesting uh, spaghetti junction coming up. No, we can't. We can't get round through this mess. Well, we can if we move that signal. Let's move that signal. You. Go there instead. Beautiful. I mean, it's going to be a bit congested here, but I can't really see any other way to do this. Right, we have the beginnings. We're going to uh, actually build bridges over here, though. I don't want them to intersect too often. So this is going to be a bridge. We we might as well put in the cool bridge, right? The, uh, the beastie one. That's all you need. Uh, suspension bridge, please, because it'll look cool. 
Excellent. We're going to finish that quest today, that's for sure. I do like the diesel era so far. It, it's made it a bit a bit more complicated, hasn't it? We could uh, go here, right? We could indeed. If we go like that. Surely that will give us what we need. We're going to have two stations. Uh, I don't know if we're going to ever pull wood in, but we are going to need to release some goods. Baths right there as well. If we put two stations in, uh, we can we can get rid of some of that. That will give us that, but for, for our uh, oil train that we have going on here, yeah, that kind of works. I would have preferred to come out further then, but uh, this works. We'll make the wiggle right at the beginning. Uh, right at the end as he's slowing down for the station anyway. That shouldn't that shouldn't do much to it. Where is where are we gonna have to hook up here? We're gonna have to go behind here. I would like us to bridge over here. Uh is that the one? That's the one. Yes, we'll take that. I mean we're going through our iron, but that's fine. We're gonna need this hooking up regardless. We'll do the same there, hopefully. Should be about... Nope. Uh, didn't click on it. Didn't click on the bridge. There. Beautiful. Take that. 68 miles an hour. Now what we're we doing? We could plow through the forest, which would be awful news. Oh, that forest is right in the way, isn't it? I guess we could make our way over now. What does it recommend? It can't work that out. Of course it can't. Well, we'll avoid... What are you doing? Why are you dancing? Where are you going? You've kind of lost the plot a bit. We probably didn't need that bridge to be... I don't know what we're doing with this forest. I want to stay clear of that forest. Uh, we can come past Bath. Let's come out of here. I think that gives us what we need. I think that's fine. It's a bit messy, but I think it's fine. Which way round are you going? This way. That way. Beautiful. We are all signalled up. We have signals on bridges now. Oh, another bit of update. Bridges will actually go over signals. I don't know whether I remember to tell you guys that, but they uh, will go over the signals now. If you remember, we had a bit of issues with that. So how are we doing here? I mean, it's slow going. We are... By the looks of things, keeping up with production. Maybe we can increase the loading speed. Let's try that. Extensions. Let's put... Uh, maybe that will help. That should increase the throughput there. And it will help with our loading our oil train. We need a way to get over. We should have lots of ways to get over, really, shouldn't we? Oh, we could go here, couldn't we? We could make a little little switch thing like there like we can just scoot around there beautiful we'll need another signal here that should give us everything we need to get on there oh if i if i uh, uh overwrote that i don't know what i've done there oh that looks ugly is it just as aesthetic? I don't know. What's going on there? Can we uh, can we tidy that up? Do you know what? I'm I'm just gonna delete it because it makes me sad. I, I don't know what you're doing there. You make me sad like that. There we go. Now you look beautiful. I mean, I guess we could just go right at the end of the station. There we go. I like that. I think that will work. And you know what's going to run this bit, don't you? It's a GS. We're going to go full on diesel. Uh, not diesel, steam. Let's get us an engine. What? Oh, what does they take? What do they take? What, what are our options? We've got... Oh, we look at the iron. It's, it's shot through the roof now. That's beautiful. Let's get it. Let's do it. Wagons. Uh, how many of these? 
probably a lot. I think we're going to be good. Or maybe not. I might have mis misjudged that. We are quite a bit short. All right. Oh, we can get another one. Get in there. So what's the maximum? Well, the oil. Oil barrels. We're only looking at 40 tons per per wagon. I do think we're... I do feel like we're, we're making enough, though. Iron. Oh, what have I got it on slow speed for? Oh, because we're doing quests. That's why. I thought there was a reason. Yeah, there we go. See? Progress. Now we need to trans <laughs> look at the timing. Excellent. We'll do that. We're about to do that anyway. So we can speed this up. What year is it? 1959. Just at the beginning of 1959. I think we've made good progress. I really do. We still need to get that iron throughput though. We're, we're kind of struggling on that. I would like to get as much of this through as possible. It's a long old journey. That that way we could only maybe have one train go through. We could indeed do his orders while we're waiting. What speed we got it on? Three works. Let's do three. Uh, that will be his first order. Or oh, he might go the wrong way though. If we put it there. Then. Oh. Yeah. See. No toggle for that. We end up selecting it. It's awful. Um. Let's click on that again, and we'll click on it a, a millionth time. Um, you go there, and I think that'll do. Then, I think I think you're good. You can figure out the rest. You've got no choice. Right? Can we buy? Yes, we can. How big is he? Okay, we can we can have another couple of wagons on. Beautiful, and another, and one more. One more and we can go. Off you pop. <laughs> I can hear the train on fast forward. There's our... Oh, wrong one. There's our big boy. I was going to thought he was going to go the wrong way then. I slightly panicked. He is carrying a lot of oil. How much exactly? 168. You, sir, are beautiful. And there's our little shunter, running backwards and forwards. I, I think he's keeping on top of that, to be fair. We're not losing any money. We could take a look, actually, before we end this episode. This is what we're going to be doing, then. We're going to be questing in the next, in the next installment. Uh, we're going to be questing. We're going to be making sure we can get some more iron. Uh, we're going to be increasing our oil production. That seems like it's going to be a thing. I feel like we could maybe do some goods. Just, I mean, it's going to be on the platform. I don't know whether it's going to lock up the platform if we don't shift it. Maybe that's what it's for. As you can see, our income is... Let's have a look for last year. You'd really need it without the vehicles brought. But fuel... It's just cash we're using and... And coal tokens... The money tokens and coal tokens is all we're using. And now income is 635 coal tokens from stations. Uh, yeah, we got, we, we've got bags of room there. Our money is just through the roof. We don't need to worry about that at all. Excellent. So he's on his way. He is a long, long train. We, uh, and how many? So he's going to complete. Let's speed, <laughs> let's speed that up. He's going to complete that quest on his first run. Uh, what I would like to do before he gets here. Is there any extensions we could use? I mean, 5-3? Maybe. I mean, yeah. Not overly bothered. He'll pull in there. Great sound, but he's doing that. This quest should be going. We got our first look at that. Our first day in the third era and we have oil tokens. That's not bad, is it? That's not bad at all. We, we I did a bit of faffering around. But it was worth it. We're kind of unloading a bit slow. Do you know what we could do? 
kind of unloading a bit slow. I would like you... I don't know where I'd like you, to be honest. Just go there. Well, we've done the quest, anyway. Go there. Why not? Maybe that'll speed you up a bit. Collect this, some cash. Now what? Is that it? Are we just done? Alrighty. We could probably use uh, more of a tick. How much does he carry? 168. And how much are you producing? You're not going to even have enough, are you? And we're staying on top of that. Unless... Unless... Yeah, we've got to, haven't we? We've just got to... We just got to do this. Just more, more oil. Black gold. Get it out there, because you're not really going to support this train. And he's steaming down here, quite literally. See what I did there? I think that's that's an episode. We've got a lot to do. We've got a lot more to hook up, but I did want to get that started. Just so we're beginning to get our oil tokens. I mean, we could just skip to the... <laughs> I mean, what's the, what's the quest? Yeah, we could, we could like, go. But I'm not going to. And I'll tell you why. I want to know if there's more quests. That's what I want to know. Let's watch our train. Let's watch this junction, shall we? To end it. So thank you for watching, guys. That's our first intro. Oh, you know, every time. you It's almost guaranteed. There we go. We've got a quest. And I do like the tokens it's offering. So we are going to set up some goods. Beginning of next, uh, the, the next episode. Definitely. Episode 11 is going to be about setting up some goods to begin with. Expanding our... Uh, well, there's no time limit on that. Three different cities. Wow. Three different cities. There's a little mission we've got going for us. Well, aren't we going to be busy next episode? It's absolutely hectic. That's going to be a lot of fun, though. We've got a lot of tracks to uh, sort out. Oh, we could have a bit of... Look at all the trains going through our junction. That is perfect. Lots to do. Lots to do. We are going to eventually make our way to the fourth era, but let's quest first. In the third era, let's make sure we can make lots of this oil. I mean, this kind of works, right? I mean, it's a bit of a mess of a junction, but it doesn't look like anything's being blocked, so that's a good thing. Brilliant. Thank you for watching, guys. If you like that, drop a like. Uh, if you haven't subscribed yet, please do so. We are very close to a thousand subscribers, which is which is crazy, absolutely crazy. It's all thanks to you guys. And there goes another another quest. We're going to look at that when we come. We're going to look at that when we come back. Not now. We're going to end it looking at our uh, our newly created oil train. He's amazing. Coming through the nightmare of a junction. And until next time, take care.